Sup everybody, Logan here, Stock Investor, aka Crypto Investor, back with another video. Today we're going over the SWE NS token. Ticker symbol is NS. Now this stands for the SWE Blockchain Name Service, just like Ethereum Name Service, ENS, uh, which was very popular when it came out. There was tons of spin-offs, like, uh, you know, pick a blockchain, basically, you know, uh, Binance, Name Service, etc. Now we have a SWE NS token uh, getting a very big central exchange listing starting November 14th on a very big central exchange. We're going to go over the NS token and how you can get it in just one second. But before we do that, just quickly, I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy this token or anything like that. This is strictly just information. Take it with a grain of salt. Always do your own research first before investing in anything, especially crypto, because crypto can be very volatile. Also, there is a ton of referral codes down there in the description box. Have a look at those. Best referral codes for the best crypto apps. You can get yourself free money, free rewards, free crypto, things like that. Just by using those referral codes down there and funding your account. It's real simple. Referral codes benefit both of us. So check them out in the description box. And let's get into this token here. So you can find their uh, webpage at sweens.io. Over there, you can find lots of socials. You can also find a um, full documentation uh, section, docs.sweens.io. So the SWE name service uh, documentation is divided into two main sections, one for the user and one for the developer. So the developer section provides integration details for adding a SWE name service to your projects. And the user section provides instructions on how to use the SWE NS portal to register names and integrate them with your Web3 identity. You can use the SWE NS dashboard to link your top nav bar to jump over to SWE NS and register some names or configure the ones that you already own. So this token here was just announced on Twitter. It will be getting a very big central exchange listing. Starting November 14th at exactly 11 a.m. UTC time, this token will be listed on a central exchange called Gate. So you could download Gate from the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store or open an account on your PC at gate.io. Then you would uh, fund your account with USDT. Then on November 14th at 11 a.m. when this token gets listed, you can go into the trade section and search the ticker symbol NS and then simply just buy the token. Now I am going to put their Twitter up in the corner of the screen here as usual so you guys can easily find this project at SweetNSDAP. Gold verified check mark. It says your Web3 identity for all things SWE. You could join their Discord right there. They have a link to their webpage right there. 357,800 Twitter followers, uh, over 1,300 tweets, and uh, it says they're followed by BitMart. So most likely as it gets closer to the uh, listing date for Gate, uh, November 14th, you're going to see other central exchange listings pop up as well. I'm assuming one of them would be BitMart, and uh, but I bet you there's going to be you know, uh, a few other really big central exchanges pop up as well. Maybe Qcoin, maybe uh, Bybit, maybe MEXC Global. Uh, we'll have to wait and see, but that's why you would follow the socials here. Uh, so if Gate is not available in your country, you can get this token uh, most likely off a SWE decentralized exchange like Cetus, C-E-T-U-S, with a SWE wallet or a SWEET wallet. Or uh, you could stay tuned and uh, see more, you know, central exchange listings pop up here as well. And there's also a scallop uh, airdrop event going on. You can check that out. That started October 29th. They tweeted about that. That go actually that is yeah that one's over. But I mean if you stay tuned, 
uh, you'll see more announcements like that pop up on their Twitter here. So the SWE name service, uh, which helps your projects using either on-chain or off-chain resolutions depending on your particular use case. Uh, they have uh, developer integration with SWE NS, works in multiple ways. So for dApps, you typically integrate SWE NS through off-chain resolutions using remote procedural calls, RPCs. The calls enable you to interact with the SWE network or display names instead of addresses. For example, your RPCs might create transactions that send assets to names or show names instead of addresses on the leaderboard. Now, the resolution works in two ways. There's the lookup. A name can point to an address or an object, which is the target address. Or there's reverse lookup. An address can have the default name. So the uh, lookup uh, works in two different ways with the address, the target address, or the default address. Uh, then there's the SWE NS NFT ownership. So it says, don't use ownership of the SWE NS NFTs as a resolution method. The NFT is used as the key uh, capability to change the target address, but shouldn't be used to identify any name with an address. SWE NS NFT ownership allows an address to be set as a target address. So for the example, uh, SWE address used in the previous section can point to any address. Consequently, when you want to display your default addresses, you should trust the default address over the target address because it's guaranteed on chain. So then they go over the off chain and on chain resolutions. And uh, in the developer section, you can also read about subnames. Subnames are nested names under the parent name. Unlike regular names, there is not a cost associated with creating subnames. And then they also have the indexing section. So the indexer enables more exp expressive queries about the active do domain state as the on-chain resolution wasn't enough to power the interface. And then we have the SDK, uh, the transaction section, examples. And then if you are a user, you can look up the registered names, uh, show you how to you know, renew names, update avatars, link addresses, the SWE ID, there's node operating systems. You can check it all out, docs.sweens.io. And follow the socials. You're going to see lots of, uh, you know, announcements, uh, partnerships, and token listings coming up in the next few days. And let me know in the comments down there, what do you guys think about this project? Do you think this is a good investment or not? Like this video. Subscribe for daily crypto videos where I go over the newest coins and tokens and what their info and utility is. And thanks for watching, everybody. Y'all have a great day out there. Peace out.